Here, can mention another video review. And yes, I know it has been quite a while since my last one, but I have now reached a point in my job where I will be able to do them a bit more regularly. Maybe every day, maybe not. But that out of the way, as you can see, today I'll be taking a look at the. I guess by today's standards, he'd be roughly Voyager class. So I'll go with Voyager class Generation 1 Starscream. The OG Starscream. That's the term, isn't it? Whatever. You know, as you can see, here is his size compared to a soda can. Not too bad. His colors are the Starscream colors of a medium gray, a dark red, black, dark blue, and bits of clear pieces and a whole bunch of stickers. Top view. Bottom view. Lots of robot stuff. The toy doesn't really have all that much posability. It's a G1, what do you expect? The cockpit canopy can open which is cool. Uh, the elevators in the back can move, but that's mostly due to the transformation. Uh, as for accessories, he does come with two for this mode. His null ray can... I will get to that in a minute. His null ray cannons, which act as missiles in this mode. As you can see, they're pretty well detailed, actually. They are a spring-loaded fire mechanism. Just press this button, and I'm not sure if it's commonplace, but the spring on mine is kind of pathetic. But so is the clip. Just the lightest touch, and the missile can go firing out. Uh, not really too much else to address here, so might as well get to the transformation. I will make one note before we get into that, though. As you saw, the elevator on this side fell off and for some reason the this elevator is held on extremely weakly but it's a 30 year old toy what do you expect anyway so to start the transformation take off the missiles and just put them to the side or use the camera a bit take off the front landing gear and now what you want to do is take the elevators and swing them forward. Take these blue pieces and fold them down to be the feet. Rotate these wings forward. Bring down the cockpit just a little bit. Push through here to get the arms out. Just bring them out to the side like this for now. Got to get them past the wings, though. Take the nose of the cockpit, detach it from the main body, rotate this down, put it through, rotate that all the way down, put the cockpit back, or the cockpit nose back, then rotate the wings all the way back up. <coughs> Then you want to take the detachable fists and just snap them on like that. Wanna make sure you put them on the right hand for on the right arm first. It's actually quite easy to mix them up. And for the most part, that gives you Generation 1 Voyager class Starscream in robot mode. He is, uh, he is. Yeah. Alright, now for robot mode. And you can probably see the first problem. 
this mode, and that's the hinge that holds this here is extremely weak, so his belly just kind of flops in place and doesn't do as it's supposed to. Yeah. But that said, here's his size compared to a soda can. Not too bad. As for the colors, they are unchanged from robot mode. Gray, red, blue, clear, and stickers. Lots and lots of stickers. Why do I keep saying stickers like that? I wonder why. Well, anyway. As for posability, it's a G1. He can wave at you menacingly. As for accessories, he has the exact same ones as before. His no ray cannons, except now, instead of these little cone things, we will use these. The needles. I guess. And they just slot in there like before. As for attaching them, there are big holes here on the sides of his arms. Just take these pegs, put them into the port, and done. Same for the other side. Nice and simple. At any rate, there you have him with his null rays equipped. And yes, they do still fire. But that's G1 Starscream. For the time, probably a pretty good toy. Nowadays, it would probably not do very well. But I think it's pretty cool. I got it in the thrift shop for like. 20 bucks. Yay me. Though he is kind of in a bedraggled state. Is that the right word? Eh, whatever. And his uh, belly won't stay in place. But that about does it for my review of. Is he? No, probably deluxe class and I think about it. Whatever. Generation 1 Starscream. Bye.